Getting a TSA certification can be confusing. There's little information out there for it. In this video, I'm going to give you the two requirements for becoming a TSA certified truck driver and point you in the right direction to get started. Hi, I'm Aaron, a national sales representative with Anderson Trucking Service. TSA certification is required when a truck driver is transferring cargo from their truck to an airplane. In order to get TSA certified, you need to do two things. Number one, you need to pass a TSA security threat assessment. The security threat assessment can be done through iac.tsa.dhs.gov. Federal regulations state that the TSA STA, is required for each individual who has unescorted access to cargo and access to information that such cargo will be transported on a passenger aircraft, or who performs certain functions related to the transportation, dispatch, or security of cargo for transport on a passenger aircraft, or all cargo as specified in the Direct Air Carrier Security Program. For more information, we will provide a link in the description below. Number two, indirect air carrier training. The second thing you need is the appropriate training. The TSA requires each IAC to adopt and carry out a TSA-approved security program that meets current TSA requirements and is renewed annually. TSA principal security inspectors are the primary points of contact for the application process and approval of certification. Persons or entities interested in becoming an IAC can submit an application online via the indirect air carrier management system. Once TSA receives the completed application, it may take approximately 90 to 120 days for final approval. For further information on the application process or any other cargo-related information, please contact the TSA Contact Center via their website. Along with TSA certification, there are many other certifications that may apply to your cargo. If you click here, you will get more information on tanker endorsements. If you click over here, you will get more information on shipping DOD military freight. Thank you and we'll see you in the next video.